you guys, Cam McClellan. Al Lewison. Welcome today. Welcome today's Wealth Squad. We've got uh, Nick McDougall from API, the new editor. You're not really new anymore, are you, Nick? No, five months now, Cam. Five months, there you go. Chris Burnie down in Melbourne for the weekend for the Expo. That's right. We wanted to talk to Nick um, from API. We wanted to, to give a bit of background, introduce yourself to our viewers on where, what her background is, and then give a bit of an understanding of the uh, the new look and feel for Australian Property Investor Magazine. Nick. Yes, Cam. Where are you from, and what have you done? Uh, what have I done my whole life, or no, just about property? Just about property, no one cares really what you've done. Uh, okay, alright. You're just about to walk in front of the camera. <laughs> Start again? No, 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 okay, no, no. carry on. We right. never start again. Okay, right. Um, so yeah, I've been at API for the last five months now. Um, I'm, I'm the editor, of course. A uh, property journalist. Uh, previously, uh, I was at the Real Estate Institute of Queensland as one of the yep. executive managers for uh, many, many years. Yep. Um, but you know, I have been focusing on the property market now for a, a very, very, very long time, and I've been a property investor myself. Fantastic. Very important. API. Very important. We've got a new look and feel for Australian property investor mag. Nick, tell us what you. Um, what you're trying to improve, um, yes. you've got a good mag to start with. Yes, um, that's right. We didn't want to, I mean obviously when I when I started, um, I didn't want to, you know, reinvent the wheel. We've got a very successful successful formula. Um, API, you know, has been, we're actually just working at the moment on our 17th uh, year anniversary crazy. Uh, edition. Uh, so we've been around for a very, very long time. Um, our readership figures are also uh, on the way up. Just jumped up 11.5% um, over the last quarter. So we've got about 136,000 people per month. A lot of people. Uh, are uh, reading API, so um, in print or in line, or in line? Uh, bo uh, 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 both actually. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. So the uh, vast majority of our readers are still like the hard uh, copy format. Um, came on board. We thought it was a good time to have a look at the magazine. Yep. Uh, what we've done is just a few tweaks, yep. um, not changing everything wholesale. Um, we're keeping obviously, you know, a lot of the content in there. We've still got investor profiles. We still have young guns. Yep. What you might notice a little bit different in the magazine is um, an increase in your more high level. Um, investment uh, advice, property investment advice. For the, the, the rookie investors as well as the ones that people are advanced. Yeah, well, I mean, we've yeah. been around for a long time, and, and it's important yeah. that we, you know, provide information to people at every step of their property investment journey, yeah. not just at the beginning. Yeah. Uh, so we've actually got a couple of new sections, a how-to section, yeah. um, and the latest issue actually, which is um, going on sale tomorrow, um, is a how to run the numbers. So that's about property development, and it's about you how you can look at um, a development site and do all your numbers before you actually purchase Absolutely. something. I think I mean it. Oh, I might have you. Oh, there you go. Cam. That's right, it does too. <laughs> oh, there you go. Um, but we've also got a new section called Advanced Investor, and um, that'll change every month. Yep. But uh, as an example, this month we've actually, um, the story is actually about the importance of leases when you're buying commercial real estate. So, yeah. if, you know, more advanced investors are obviously looking probably at commercial real estate, like you guys do. Um, and that's a completely different kettle of fish than yeah. buying residential. So, Very true. Um, we'll Very have true. some more sections along, along those lines. And this month as well, we've just got a bit of a new look and Feel. Um, just a bit of a tweak, a bit of Botox, as I like to call it, uh, for the magazine, uh, just to sort of give it a bit of a zhuzh and uh, make it a little bit um, more eye catching, I suppose. Yeah, nice one. Um, I've got to say, 17 years, Nick, it's, uh, it's a pretty impressive feat for, for any magazine, and to see the print, um, the print side of things actually going up is, is sort of countering what every other magazine print is doing in the industry. Um, I do have to say I have the number one Australian property investor magazine that came out in November in 97. That's so, right. You had a cover on the wall in the office. Yeah, yeah, there there you you? Oh. Yeah, so there you go. Okay. Okay. Well, we've also actually some, something else in the magazine we've got new, which is um, we've always had like you know a digital version of the mag, yeah. but um, I've actually got quite a strong data, probably data background as well. And so um, since the edition before this one, we've actually got a digital data supplement every month, yeah. uh, which people can access by buying the magazine and you can just scan a code and go to a special website which has um, all of the asking price sellers asking price data across the country by postcode, yeah. as well as a whole heap of top ten and bottom ten. A great tool. Results. Yeah, exactly. So it's all about making sure that our readers have access to you know, the most robust amount of data possible so that they can make informed buying decisions. Well, well, I know you've also got a foreign buyer's guide. Uh, yes, uh, yeah, in the next few months, hopefully, uh, we'll be launching a, a bilingual uh, digital go. supplement to the magazine, which, um, you know, is, is really sort of targeted towards sort of Asian investors of, of Australian real estate and giving them all the information also that they need to um, buy. You know, buy, buy the best way that they can. Awesome. Now, for all the wealth waters out there, we constantly talk about keeping that first for knowledge going. Um, well, the sounds of it, API has got it covered across the broad spectrum of rookie, novice, advanced. Uh, so, great magazine. Keep your eyes out. Cheers, guys. Thank you. Good day.